Hey Vibe Makers, it's Lila with LP Novelties and today's video is going to be a vlog. It's a day of, you guys asked, kind of just wanted to see how I create content and like a day of planning. So I thought why not create a video showcasing what goes on on a day I designate to content creating. So that is today. Um, it's late at night already, but I am filming the intro now because I totally forgot to film it in the beginning. But y'all, I'm learning how to do these vlogs and um, I'm hoping to bring some more here in the future of my channel. So let me know in the comment section below um, if you guys enjoy these types of videos. If you'd like to see more vlog style videos, let leave in the comments. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed. And if you have, welcome here to the Vibe Maker Tribe. And um, yeah, I'm gonna bring you guys along to just see what I do on a day designated to content creating. Just like a little couple of clips and just showing you kind of like how I film reels and take photos and just start the morning off. Always start the morning off um, setting up my bed. So let's get to that clip and I hope you guys enjoy this video. Makers, it's a day of in my life of when I do content creating. I figured I'd vlog it. I've gotten a lot of questions of how do I choose to film videos, um, how I film my videos, and how I create content, and also just like a day of planning. So I figured I'd combine it all and bring you guys along on a day I select to create content. And life's pretty busy. I'm doing um, two part times right now. So tomorrow I'll be working again. And I figured today's my one day where like, I don't have to be mom, um, chances that it's dad. So it's just a day where I designate to create content. I will give myself some me time at, in the afternoon or maybe I'll bring you guys along. Cause I am still kind of shopping for Go Wild. I'm going to Go Wild in March. It's a planner conference. Um, but yeah, I figured let's just do a little vlog video. Um, you all know, throw in some clips and just show you like kind of what I do in the morning and um, kind of my setup for filming. Just kind of what I'm planning on filming. All right, so here's a little behind the scenes of how I film. I figured I'm gonna bring you guys along for my day. And today I'm just like planning on filming some videos. Um, I'm probably gonna do reels and just stick to this being my YouTube video. And um, it's just how I can balance enough stuff to do in one day. Cause like I'm designating today my content creating day and hopefully I can get a little bit of shopping done for a while. Cause like it's my one free day of the week. But anyway, so um, this tripod y'all always are asking I honestly do not know how my dad made it. So it is a just like a regular like tripod for a camera. And then he added this bar to it. And then he also added this to hold. And then he drilled a hole so I could hold my phone in here. It's pretty high tech. <laughs> and it's just him being super creative. I'm really grateful for him. And then he also found this top for me because I was just filming on my white vanity top. This is actually my vanity where I put my makeup on, but it's also my YouTube section filming and it's just making it work with that I have the space I have here in my room. And you guys, I still have to kind of decorate this. Um, I got this shelf at Ikea, like I think before Christmas and I still haven't put a picture, but hashtag just keeping it real. Uh, I wanted to kind of designate this kind of like a cute little Disney section. So I want to print out a picture of the castle that I took and then maybe put like some cute little things. So that's kind of what I'm planning. Um, and then this is like all my makeup here. Normally it sits on my vanity, but when I film, it all goes over here. I probably put my makeup on right now. And then I just like to kind of hang um, items that are themed to like kind of the, the month and the season. So right now, you know, we're like in winter. So some sweaters, a little bit of pink. And then I just found this cute cardigan at TJ Maxx. And I just love it. I'm gonna take some pictures with it for Valentine's. Maybe I'll do some pictures today. Um, but yeah, this is basically when you guys see me film plan with me, um, the camera sits right up here and I just, you know, I film and, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Hello, there I am. But yeah, behind me is a really big mess cause I have been shopping for a good wild. Um, and it's just, it's getting messy. And this is normally where I take my outfit of the day picture right here. I have my, my little, um, mirror here and y'all outfit of the day is pajamas cause I just woke up and I'm bringing you guys along. <laughs> All right, so you guys saw the setup. I'm gonna go ahead and put my makeup on and then 
I'll film this portion, which are my reels and my spreads, then I can go and take photos because I want to take regular photos. So another thing that I'm really loving right now is um, Bare Minerals. Um, Bare Pro is my new fave foundation. And it, I'm using Fair 15 Cool. When I tried it at, at the store, it was warm, or I believe neutral, but this is the color I'm using. And it just comes like that, a little mirror. So I'm really loving that for my skin and making it look um, like natural, not look like I have a lot of makeup on. I don't like that whole like, heavy makeup look. Um, so I just normally just do concealer and the mask in me is real but it's gotten better now um, and I just do powder loose powder but this one I feel like really covers really well done normally it doesn't take this long but just when i've decided to do like curly hair it takes a little bit longer just to curly especially that i've cut my hair shorter it makes a difference um just contemplating whether i want to get a thicker curling hair and that's what i was thinking while i was getting this done and then i just spent some time like catching up on instagram and uh engaging and just good times but yeah i like how it looks curled got some texture so now i'm gonna set up to film reels. I'll probably go eat some breakfast and then start filming. I'm kind of getting hungry. I haven't had breakfast yet. <laughs> All right, guys, I just got done with breakfast. I gave myself some time to just sit and like eat because normally like on content creating days, I tend to like hold off on eating because I'm just trying to get everything done and then I'm like hungry. So I wanted to make sure I had a good breakfast um, because I probably won't be eating uh, maybe till like right now it's 11 30 so I probably won't eat till like 4 35 just because like I just want to get all this done and relax for the rest of the day and you guys I love creating content for you guys I love my vibe makers and I want to make sure um, I'm creating good content for you guys and trying to be like having fun at the same time and like creating stuff that I love but sharing it with you guys so that's just basically how I kind of um, choose to film and I'm just trying to get here in the light and my arm. Y'all, I don't know how people do this vlogging with holding this camera up. This camera's pretty heavy. Uh, but I'm just gonna keep my PJs on because I'm just gonna do now. What I'm planning on doing is it's 11.30. The light's okay, but I'm gonna wait till it's a little bit, um, a little bit like brighter so I can do my lifestyle photos. My lipstick already came off with breakfast, but it's fine. But I just wanted to have the makeup ready so when I get done with the reel, I'll set up the area where I'm gonna fit, where I'm gonna, excuse me, where I'm gonna photograph and um, just take a couple of lifestyle photos because I love incorporating lifestyle um, on my feed and then also just trying to put some cute outfits together. I might just do one today, um, but yeah. And maybe I'll share with you guys if I have time today, kind of the stuff I've been um, finding for Go Wild. I love putting outfits together. That's something I love to do too. Um, so yeah. Y'all, I'm serious, I have no idea how people do this vlogging. Um, my arm's long, but I'm trying to keep it where it's like far away. <laughs> Hashtag keeping it real. But um, I'm gonna show you guys that now, like the portion where I, I film and you guys get to see kind of how I do it. All right, so this is a portion where I set up for reels and for today's spread, um, this is for the week of 17th through the 23rd. Again, I'm not sure when I'm posting up this vlog, but 
I like to pre-film and then just get the content out to you guys. But um, this is basically how I film my reels. I have this tripod um, my dad made me set up my phone and then I try to make sure I have um, they have a it's like a grid line grid that you can select as a photo setting or video setting on your phone so make sure you have that it really helps me to make sure I keep my planner lined up to those lines and in case I move my planner I remember to always line it back there and it keeps the placement the same when you're doing real so I like to do it like that and for this spread I wanted to have fun um, the 17th of course is Martin Luther King Jr. Day but it's also Betty White's would have been would have been Betty White's 100th birthday and I really loved Betty White and she was just a great human being and a, a, a special memory I have of her is just watching Golden Girls with my mom. I loved watching it when I was younger with my mom and somehow I kind of uh, felt connected to the character Rose because she was silly and gullible and uh, I feel like sometimes I'm like that so I want to dedicate the spread to Betty White for her 100th, would have been in her 100th birthday on the 17th so I'm going to do a draw with me real instead of doing it on YouTube because I asked on my, my Instagram story people like to see on reels and youtube and reels one but i'll probably bring back drawing here on my youtube channel don't worry it's just uh depends to like um what time frame i have so i just want to kind of draw easily without having to talk um sometimes if i just sit and draw i don't have to really worry about um more of the not the behind the scenes but the the conceptualization i can't even say that word conceptualization of the video um, because you have to think about the intro, talking it through, explaining the stickers, and when it's a real, you just like draw and put it um, with music and you're good to go. So that spread is going to be for my everyday and then my social will just be a regular sticker spread that I'll film on a reel. But I'll probably film that later tonight once I take my photos. So like this is going to take me at least an hour, an hour and a half. Drawing does take me a long time when it comes to these types of spreads. So it'll probably be minimum an hour. So that's why I'm doing it right now, getting that out of the way and then I will edit it later tonight. Um, I'm hoping to post it either tomorrow or Monday. Um, but I also want to take my photos and then I'll come back later tonight because like with this lighting, it doesn't matter if it's daytime or not. All right, so for this portion of the video, you guys, um, I had to turn, or not turn, close my blinds because um, I look at my lighting in my phone. And I'm just making sure that like it's nice and bright and clear. And when I'm doing the full full spread, I was noticing a little, a little bit yellow, so I just have to close the blinds. So the lighting's a little off with the camera, but it's all good. But it's looking really cute. I'm loving my Betty White here. And now that I drew, for this portion of the reel, I'm just gonna go in and use stickers. And I'm thinking I might use, I'm trying to see if I use um, this new one from Mojo Jojo. All right, guys, I just finished the draw with me reel. It came out so cute. I love how it turned out. Um, I had a vision of how I wanted it, but then I got inspired by the florals and sometimes that's what happens. I'll have a vision of a spread and then I'll just 
um, kind of start drawing and then looking at stickers and like, a, you know, stickers will just call my attention and be like, okay, I think this will work. And I think that's something to keep in mind is when you're doing like spreads, if again, if you're falling into this channel, you're like, what is she talking about spreads? Um, I do plan with me's, um, but if you are a planner and been following me for a while and love to plan and decorative planning, um, I think allow it to be organic. I, um, it's good to have an idea of what you want, but sometimes it's fun to just kind of allow the sticker to speak to you and, and let the creative process happen naturally and organically. And I'll show you guys a really quick look at it. So I'm gonna flip this over, uh, but how stinking cute did this come out? And there's Miss Betty White right there. I just kind of wanted to give her like that, like Golden Girls era drawing and then um i really love these quotes and just like the the, uh, the font of it i feel like it goes with the flow of the florals i know i'm just I'm just feeling it you know and uh really really love these boxes from jojo i'm gonna i'm excited to try them out actually fill them in this is my first time using her boxes and um let me just show you guys real quick let me grab that sticker book um, but it's this sticker book. It's uh, pastel boxes. I kind of wish I had another one. Hopefully she restocks because this one is beautiful. You guys know how much I love pastels and like look how gorgeous it looks. All right, y'all. I'm done with the reel for Draw With Me. I will film my social media spread reel later tonight. Um, and I'll probably might film my other two reels. So I like to do my plan with me. and reels are just easier and um, save um, more fun content for YouTube. Like just think of other um, things I can do for YouTube. But um, I'll probably film those tonight too, the ones for not that I'm posting up this week, but the following week. And it's just easier for me that way, um, just to get the content if I have a free day to get it all done. Um, Cause I'm busy, like I'm doing two part times and just being a mom and everything else. So I'm trying to make some time for me too, and get stuff done. So what I'm gonna do now is I have my little mini ring light. I don't wanna have to set up the big ring light cause I wanna kinda take advantage of the natural light. And that's what I was waiting for this time frame. Um, I have a hold here that hold up. I'm just gonna put a simple white drape. I want it to be kind of a very like organic boho vibe for this lifestyle photo shoot that I'm gonna do. Um, that's why I curl my hair. So I'm gonna set that up first and then I'll change my outfit out. Of course, I'm gonna take pictures of DJ. guys so um this is basically like what i like to photograph on i'm hoping to invest in like um there's like special paper that they have for photography that's like down the road just to have like one roll color and then maybe invest later but i just wouldn't know where to store it so that's the only other issue this is really easy to store um and i have my ring light here i could bring out the bigger one but i just wanted to make it really super simple and kind of play with the light and shadow um since so that's kind of my goal for this month is to play around with my photography so that's as easy as it is, and now I'm gonna go and change out my outfit. All right, so I just switched out into something really simple and cute. I have an idea of what I wanna do. Um, I have this in gold, and I've already photographed it in gold with the black underneath, and I just have this white um, like cami dress, and this is supposed to be kind of like a minty green, so I can even like photograph like this. Um, I'm gonna photograph here with my camera, but I'll put my, I my iPhone on so I can um, film like, kind of like the process, like a little behind the scenes. You guys can see it but it's just me having fun and i think that's the most important thing is to have fun when you're creating content so i'm gonna get that started all right guys outfit number two you guys how cute is this i can't wait to wear this just like out and about um so this is that cardigan that i found i have this cami I just had from H&M, it's like $6. And then a headband I got during the holidays uh, for $3 at Target. These really adorable heart hoops, I believe are also from H&M. And I got them maybe a year, maybe two years ago. So I'm just making like a really cute, you know, vibe for Valentine's and then I'll do my little Pixar gifts and stuff. And this is a really easy way to, um, to like have fun with like lifestyle shoots. 
so it could be Valentine's Day themed. Oh my god, I love this outfit. I just want to rock this. Oh, and then these denim, I believe, are I think they're like Target. You guys, I can't remember. I believe they're Target. So <laughs> now let's get to this photo shoot. All right, Vibe Makers, that is the end of the photo shoot. I'm probably just gonna relax now. I've been vlogging all day, but I'm probably just gonna go and do some shopping for the wild. Um, if I do go shopping, I'll probably add some clips in here, but if not, this is probably the end of the vlog. I really had fun trying now a day of content creating and bringing you guys along for vlogging. Um, let me know if you guys wanna see more vlog videos here of just like my days and like what I do. Um, I won't show videos like with Chance. Um, I just keep them off of social and, and here on YouTube, but anything like with me, like if it's fashion or um, maybe storage or whatever, or just out and about, let me know, maybe try new places. Definitely gonna be incorporating some Disney um, travel vlogs here. So I'm hoping to get those in this year, but let me know in the comments what you guys would like to see. Um, I had a blast bringing you guys along just to see kind of like what I do in one day of content creating so that's pretty much it i love y'all and stay safe and um if you are new to my channel make sure you subscribe i'm so happy to have you here in the vibe maker tribe don't forget to hit the like button um it helps me to keep creating content here and it helps me here on my youtube channel it's really easy just to hit that thumbs up guys and then um also um make sure you hit the notification bell to let you know when i posted my most recent video and i'm just trying to remember this off the top of my head because it's a little bit of a different concept of filming versus like when i just sit there and it's just i remember everything um but i hope you guys had fun coming along with me and just seeing me behind the scenes and um i really had fun doing it so let me know if you guys want to see more vlogs i love y'all and peace and love